What is up everybody out there? Artists of Strong Style here. Here again, we're gonna continue on Knights of the Old Republic. So, you're inside the Volcar base, but you still have to locate the prototype accelerator. It's probably stored somewhere off the main level, under heavy guard. So pretty much that means we're going to deal with a lot of <laughs> Volcars right now. So, alright, further ado, here we go. Now a droid, okay. All right, that is done. All right, supplies. Let's see what we got. Med pack, computer spike, and parts. All right, that's good. Okay, that's more droids, and that's not good, but as always, we gotta take them down. Oh god. Alright, level up. Even though if my life is a little down, always when you have level up, it's gonna increase your life right back up. So, level up. Skills. Still, I can only have one point. So, what do I want? So, let's see, let's see. Treat injury, I can do that, or maybe I could just wait and have my points until I could increase one, but see, demolitions, no, computer use, no. Persuade. Um, I think I'm just fine. I'm just gonna. Oh, you have to choose a skill. Oh, that's not. It's been a while, but I guess you have to use one. So I'm gonna go with keeping my awareness up. Pete's. Now let's see what I can have this time. I still can't master my fury. I already mastered my we weapon proficiency. Dueling. Improved dueling. Contain focus on the use of single one-handed weapons. Grants a character plus two to attack and a plus two to defense. This applies to both range and melee weapons. So yes, I will do that. I'm going to add it. And I accept. And yeah, I'm up to a bit of light. Which is good. Now let's see. Please don't hurt me. I just serve the food here, that's all. I'm not like these others. I'm not even a black bulker. Please don't kill me. How did you end up here with the Volcar base? Don't worry, I'm just here for a few questions. If you want to live, no, I'm not going to kill you. I promise I will not kill you. So, how did you end up? My name is Ada. My father owed Davik some money, but he couldn't pay. Davik killed my father and sold me into slavery here at the Volker compound to pay off the debt. 
You better give me some information if you want to live. Nah, leaving you up alive is too risky. Sorry, sister. Like, I'm gonna order you up. No. <laughs> if you go, can you find your way out of here? Don't worry, I'm only here to ask some questions. I'm just a prisoner here, a slave. The workers don't tell me anything. They treat me like dirt. They beat me up if I screw up their orders. You may know more than you think. Where can I find that a prototype swoop engine accelerator? What? I, I never heard of such a thing. I guess it might be in the garage on the lower level. That's where all the Volkers go to work on their swoop bikes. But I've never been down there. I'm looking for a prisoner. A woman named Bastila. If I let you go, can you find your way out of here? Leaving you alive? No, I'm not going to kill you, so there's no need to do that. Mentioned her, but she's not here. He said Brezhik didn't trust his men around her. I guess she's too important. Um, if I let you go, can you find your way out of here? Now that you killed the guards who were supposed to watch me, I think I could find my way out of here. Hurry then, get yourself out of here. I'm free to go? You're not going to kill me? Like I said, I'm not going to kill you. I'm trying to be a good person, not be evil, because I choose to be good. Yes, my level's going up now to light. I'm not going to the dark. Alright, grenades, med packs, good. This is not good. Centuries, okay. Okay, what are we dealing with? A lot of That's good right there. I know, I, I know I'm using two blades for now, but when it comes down to you could get a better blade then I will choose to go one to one combat using only one weapon right now I have to stick with using two of course you can bash doors if you can to open them up grenades okay now what I can do also, I forgot, is I can switch your weapons. What blades are you using? Okay, equipment blast. Blaster pistol. Alright, I'll let you stick with what you have since you're using your own blaster. Okay, mission, I know you're using a I'm gonna, I'm gonna have you have two pistols now. I know you have a blade, but I see you like shooting, so... Yes. You're gonna have two blasters, not one. Credits, med packs are very, very good to have. 
We'll bash the security door. And a black Volcar's in here. I surrender, surrender, please don't kill me. I'm gonna. What are you talking about? You're a Volcar, aren't you? Sorry. I only fight to the. No, I'm not gonna fight to the death. Take me for example, I used to be one of the highest ranked Volcars in the game, King. Okay? If you hate the Bregic so much, why don't you leave the gang? You better give me some informa information if you want to leave. I'm going to let you live. Get out of here. Don't need to thank me. Just get the heck out of here. <laughs> If there's a way I can it can just say I can let you go, I'll let you go. <laughs> if I have to do something to let you go, well then I will do that too. But if it just says I have to kill you, well then I got no choice but to do that. But I really don't want to do that. There are a lot of people here, so this is not gonna go well. Wow, okay, that pretty much sucked. Okay, let's get away from you because you're using a blaster. You don't really want to get close to someone by using a blaster. Alright, that's it. Time to use grenades, man. Finally. If you're using a pistol, don't get close to them. Get the remains. A hundred credits. Concussion grenade. A pass card. Before we go anywhere else, let's see what's around here. Med packs. Alright, now I'm really going to have to increase my life back up. So, this time I'll use the advanced one. Okay, that put me up. Alright, you're gonna need some life, so I'm gonna have to boost you up a bit. Okay, you're fine. Let's go back. Remains. Another pass card, 100 credits, and an energy shield. Very, very well done. Very, very good to have. Foot locker. Okay, I already went through this, so this is. Let's see what else is around here. Med pack, all right, good, good to have. All right, then let's um,
That was poison, which is not good. A patrol droid, and it don't seem like there's only one of it, so let's get through it. Alright. Let's see what the map shows. Okay, the blue right there arrow, that's where I'm at. So the barracks, to the sewers, to the rec room, armory, control room, and to the barracks. Did I deal with the barracks already? Yes, I have. And I got the supplies already. So that's good. Alrighty then. Where to next? Okay. Lower city. Armory. Note the pool, which you don't want to go to. And to sewers. So. I guess we have to go to the sewers because the lower city is where we have gone through already. Pursuers. All right, let's see what's there. Okay, that's where we were before, so... No, I guess that was the wrong place to go to, so I guess we're going to have to go to the lower city. Unless I missed something. Yeah, okay, we already went through here, so no need to do that. Yes, yes, lower city we're going to have to go to. Let's just make sure one more time. We are at... Alright, pool, droid, and no. Let's see. Rec room, armory... Control room, okay, let's see if, what happens if you get into the control room. Okay, nothing there, so I guess no choice but to head into the lower city since... Is that where we're going to? Yes, we are. Okay, lower city.
That's a lot of black vault cars. But then again, when you're far away, there's something you do. Throw grenades. <laughs> When you've done that much damage to one, look how close you are to going against one. Upper City North, is there something missing? Alright then, most likely we have to go back because we still have not found the prototype. So yes, we did get mission, and then yes, I did promise Holden that I would find that prototype. So I'm still going to be looking for it. Okay, there's no need to slice it. Okay, and Sir Pass Card. Okay, I do have a Pass Card. Journal added. Let's see. You successfully shut down the thermal security system protecting the elevator to the garage. Oh, okay then. Level to the Volcar base. Now, all you have to do is go down there and find the prototype accelerator. And deal with any angry Volcars you may my along the way okay then if I didn't put the pass card these defense turrets would be wanting to shoot me but um I guess this is the way black vault car base okay so I guess we missed that part so we'll head into there now and I'm sure it said right there you will be able to find it so let's go find this prototype. So main level, so okay we're in the main level and again it said you're gonna be heavy guarded so there's gonna be a lot of black vault guards. <laughs> Okay, a patrol droid we're gonna have to go against now. Alright. Alrighty then. Wow, lucky right there. And my I'm barely close to dead right there, so that's gonna have to I'm gonna have to, yes, use med packs to increase my life back up. K 
Okay, mission. I'm gonna have to increase you up a bit. You're back up. Cart, you seem to be all right. And then just me. I'm pretty all right too. So, yeah, heavy guard. So there's gonna be a lot. We dealt with a lot so far. Okay, now gang members. All right, good. A foot locker. All right, let's see what's in here. More grenades and a couple of extra med packs. That's good. Grenades, med packs, you're always going to want to have. Supplies. Let's see. Med packs, good. Good to have. A garage computer. No, you don't want to slice it. No need to. A desk. Wow. Okay. In the desk. Pizak card, improve energy cell, and a garage head key card. Alright, so another key card. Let's open this, but it's just the other opening to this door that we were at, so. Alright. The remains, okay. Any remains? Heavy blaster and a heavy combat suit. Alright. Remains also. Frag grenades and credits. Good. I still don't know how to defuse these, so... Karth, I have no choice but to choose you to do this. Okay, that was poison. Good. Looks like we have visitors. Lax key connect Gat and Duck. All right. Rushing stole that engine from Gat. It was never yours to begin with. You're right, I'm not the one to backs. My name's Kirito. Enough, hand over that accelerator. You got my attention? What's your offer? Forget it, I'm not going to betray God. On, no. How about I just kill you instead? No, you got my attention. You're right. You were about to tell me your offer, Garden. Eh, don't listen to him, mission. mission. He's just twisting your mind. You really think I'm gonna betray you? <laughs> no. <laughs> I'm just playing it out. But I guess my plan did not work, so. Again, yes, we are just gonna have to. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
Alrighty then. A Sith energy shield remains. Let's see. I'm gonna have to increase it once again. I think you're okay, but let's just see. Frag grenade. Okay. A swoop accelerator. Okay. Items received. So I believe that was the accelerator. So let's head back now. Ah, no, no need to increase. More credits, all right. And I'm sure at some stores I can get more med packs. Elevator, let's head back. Okay, so lower city, that's not the right way to go. Let the head back. Lower city, here we go. We already, dealt, we already dealt with these Volkers here, so no need to worry about them because they are done. The hidden base, alright. Okay, everyone's in good shape. Now let's head back to Gaden. You've returned. You have the prototype swoop engine accelerator with you? I was beginning to wonder if you would make it. The race is tomorrow, and my mechanics need time to install the prototype into the swoop engine of our bike. Okay, I've lived up to the end of my deal. Now you better come through. No, I'm a man of my word. I promised you could ride in the swoop race under the hidden neck banner, and I'm still going to let you do that. And I'm even going to go one battle. I'm going to let you ride the swoop bike with the prototype accelerator and so on. Without it, you won't stand a chance. Gaddy, you can't be serious. We need one of our best riders on that bike. We can't let some rookie take the prototype engine into the race. Why are you doing this, Gaden? Zara's right, Gaden. One of your own riders. You know what? Forget it. Don't worry. I'll win the race. I have to be honest. There's a reason I'm letting you 
take the prototype engine. The accelerator was in a stable. There's a good chance it could explode during the race. I can't ask one of my own drivers to take the risk. They'll be running unmodified swoops in the race. You'll be the only one using the prototype. If you can complete the track before the accelerator overheat. Sounds like you've got Okay, I'm ready. You can stay here, Tom. The mechanics need time to install the accelerator on the engine, so you won't be able to practice your riding. But I've got good instincts. You have the look of a racer about you. Just try to relax, and in the morning we'll take you to the swoop track. We spent a ratless night in the back base. In the morning, one of the back base takes you to the swoop race pits where only racers mechanics are allowed to be allowed to go my mistake <laughs> so you're the one who's gonna take the swoop Right? Yes, I am. Forget it, just let me get to the racing. I won't let you down. Good luck, all right. Gadden has entered you as a rider in the swoop race. If you can post the fastest time, you will win the champion's prize, including Bastila. The Becks are allowing you to ride a bike equipped with a prototype accelerator, giving you a better chance to win the race if you survive. So, I suppose there could be a minus. You could die or get crashed. Well, okay, that is Bastila, but to get her, I must win the race. <laughs> Want to race. Now to do these races of course it depends on speed but you gotta be calm on your speed. <laughs> Press A to accelerate and use the left thumbstick to avoid. Now particularly you don't want to have you don't want to keep on pressing A. If you keep going too fast with A you're gonna get exploded. So here we go. And yes, you always wanna try to hit these. Well, all right then, so that was 30 seconds. Did I beat it? You did it, you got the top time. You best beat racers who've been doing this for 20 years. This is amazing. Someone who never ran a swoop bike before today comes here and wait a minute. I don't believe this. Look at the board. 
One of the Volkers just beat your time. It was Rios. Alrighty then. So I guess there must be another. It's not just gonna be one race. So, I guess another race I'm gonna have to do, and I have to beat this Volkars time, which he beat my first time, so I must win the second time. Here we go. So I suppose this is race number two. Beat the time. Twenty five seconds. Okay, that expression shows that I did it. Which okay, yes, you did it. Did it. In twenty years I never seen anybody handle a swoop like that before. Nobody's going to beat that time. Nobody. I guess Garen knew what he was doing. He picked you to ride for us. Now the only thing you have to do is beat the time to become official and collect your prize. Ladies and gentlemen, I present to you the winner of this year's Swoop Race. Put your hands together and show your appreciation for the one of the most daring riders this Swoop track has ever done. Now, here's your present, the champion's prize, Regic, leader of the block. You will hear me before I present the so-called champion of the Bex with their prize. There is something you must know. The winning rider cheated. How did I cheat? Your swoop is using a prototype accelerator. Clearly an unfair advantage. Because of this hidden bet, you can't do this. I might have something to say about that measure. What was that? <laughs> okay, that was. Um, you are restrained by a neural disruptor. How could you possibly summon the will to free yourself? You underestimate the strength of the Jedi's mind, Magic. A mistake you won't live to regret. Focus to me! A uh, Jedi's mind trick? Okay, so I suppose that's a Jedi power. So, I leveled up once again. Level up. Skills. I can only have one still, so... Treat injury is what I'm good at, most likely, so... What can I do? Still can't master it. I am going to put toughness on me, then. And I accept. My level's back up, and let's see. Do I get it? Okay, yeah, it remains. Double bladed lightsaber. Okay. I'm not particularly a Jedi yet, but a double bladed lightsaber can be used for, yes, Bastila, because she is a Jedi. And most likely. Her weapon for a lightsaber is a double-bladed yellow lightsaber, which I just picked up right now. 
Oh, remains also. So let's see what remains that we got. Okay, it was just those remains. Well, maybe those bloody buckets will think twice next time before trying to keep a Jedi prisoner. And as for you, if you think you can collect me as a prize, wait, I don't believe this. You're, you're one of the soldiers with the Republic fleet, aren't you? Yes, I'm sure of it. How did you end up racing for these swoop games? It's a long story. My name is Kirito. I'm here to save you. When the soup race wasn't the only way I could have saved you. Never mind that. I won the soup race and you're my prize. I own you now. No, that's that's not a good thing to say. So. See, is that what you were trying to accomplish by riding in that swoop race? Well, as far as rescues go, this is a pretty poor example. In case you hadn't noticed, I managed to free myself from that moral restraint collar without your help. In fact, it's more accurate to say that I saved you. Brezhnev and his followers might have left you for dead if I hadn't stopped you in that fight. You're lucky I was here to get you out of this mess. We don't have time for this. Cart is waiting for us. Carl the Nazi is alive. Finally, some good news. Carl is one of the Republic's best soldiers. He's proved himself a hero a dozen times over. And they misjudged you. Carl's going to send you if he wasn't confident in your abilities. Please take me to Carth right away. Between the three of us, I'm sure we can figure out some way to get off this planet before the Sith realize we're here. Revan, huh? Bastila, you're alive. Finally, things are looking up. Now we just need to figure out a way to get off this planet. I mean, you don't have a plan to get off Taurus yet. What have you been doing all this time? We're trying to find you, remember? Don't worry. We'll figure out something. I'm getting a little sick of you. No, 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 no. That's... We we're trying to find you. I see. Now that I'm back in charge of this mission, perhaps we can start doing things properly. Hopefully our escape from Terrace will go more smoothly than when you rescued me from Brezhik. I know you're new at this, Bastila, but a leader doesn't berate her troops just because things aren't going as planned. Don't let your people get in the way of the real issues here. That hardly strikes me as an appropriate way of addressing your commander, Karth. I am a member of the Jedi Order, and this is my mission. Don't forget that. My battle meditation ability has helped the Republic many times in this war, and it will serve us well here, I'm sure. Your talents might win us a few battles, but that doesn't make you a good leader. A good leader would at least listen to the advice of those who have seen more combat than Sheer. Both of you settle down. This isn't helping... He's right, you aren't showing much leadership ability right now, Bastila. Karth, you can't talk to a commanding officer like that. Yes, you're right. Let's see what we can do now. I apologize, Karth. This has been a difficult time for me. Of course, I'm happy to listen to your advice. What do you suggest we do? First off, we can't get hung up on who's in charge. We all need to work together if we want to get off this rock. The answer is out there. We just have to find it. Well said, Karth. The sooner we start looking, the better. I've already been a prisoner of the Vulcans, and I don't plan on being captured by the Sith. Don't worry, I won't let that happen. I think we'll need some help getting off Terrace. Maybe if we ask around, one of the locals can help us out. We should probably start by asking around in the cantinas. Is something wrong? You seem as if something's troubling you. Something weird has happened since the first time we met, like a vision. Vision? Vision what? 
of you fighting the Dark Jedi Revan, I guess. Okay, so we know Revan is a Dark Jedi. <laughs> this is strange. Such visions roll from a sign of force sensitivity. Are you saying I can use the force? I'm not sure. It may be that you have some connection to the force. Does this mean I could be a Jedi? This is complicated. Even I, with all my training, cannot fully understand it yet. This is a matter best left to the wise masters of the Jedi Council. Once we escape Terrace, we can seek the guidance of the Council if you wish. They will understand the significance of your vision. If there is any. However, I think it would be best if we all stay focused on the task at That is true. So, what's next? Basila, you experienced a powerful vision upon first meeting Basila. The vision could be that an indication that you have a strong connection with this, with the Force. But Basila was reluctant to speculate on such matters. Escaping Terrace, Basila has been found, but you still have no way to escape Terrace. Not only do you need the departure the codes to get past the sith blockade surrounding terrace you also need to find a ship you're probably going to need help from one of the locals to get off this planet all right so let's see Okay, now two characters you're gonna need. So Basil is another character, which most likely you're gonna want her because she's a Jedi. And then you're gonna need a powerful, possibly soldier. So I would go with Karth. These are my two. I will go with. Kandra's order. Isn't he the Mandalorian that works for Davik? Thanks for the message, alright. Alright, so a messenger informed that Candace Ordo, a Mandalorian working Mandalorian working for the local crime lord wants a meeting although associating with a known fion may not be the unwise move. You do need the potential allies you can get if you want to get off tires. Candace will be waiting for for you in the cantina, okay? What does Bastila have then? She has no weapon. Okay, so let's give her a weapon. Her double blade lightsaber is what we'll give her. Alright, so there you have it. I'm going to pause it from here. We'll continue on with this in the next video. So, hope you all enjoyed this. Like, comment, subscribe. As again, we're going to continue out this game in the next video. I will show you more videos of other video games, deck profiles, 
So, talk to you later, all. Peace.